Hi, I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design, and today uh, I'm back out in the factory, nice and quiet out here. And only had two orders today, but they were more than a little complicated. Uh, when I got done, I started work on my snorkel stove uh, to improve it. Now, one of the first things I did was uh, I noticed it had a little rattle to it, so I put a piece of carbon felt in the top to keep it from rattling. I may even put a piece in the bottom so it doesn't rattle. Okay. And then I... The top, I think you can see there, I put a rim on the top so that any alcohol that... Uh, runs out of the wick if you overfill it, and you're probably going to, will run out into that area and be caught uh, rather than running down the side of the stove. So uh, that's a, a safety feature, uh, and there's a lot of room to see it, so and it'll just burn off. So that's the second thing I did. Okay, now there's a problem with this stove. Big problem. Yeah. Everything has a downside. The problem is that with the machine work, you can see here uh, inside of this for the snorkel and lightening up the base and drilling in to that area, milling through this wall and then drilling into this area and then going inside and drilling down through the tower. And it has a nipple, a large nipple inside with a silicone snorkel and then I have to do this top which isn't easy because you don't have anything to hang on to because it's so small and this nipple cap which is the small they are the harder they are to make and this is a small one and this has threads cut in it and then it has goes in I cut a groove in it and then cut a, a rubber gasket and put it down and slide it into the groove which nobody else does that I've never seen anybody Everybody just glues them into the bottom and after you screw them on and off a while the glue breaks and falls out this one is actually in a groove and easily replaceable not that I've ever had to replace one and it's gotten up so this is this is a good ten dollar part then I got a carry case there's another five bucks and fuel line and basically I know this is tough to take. If I'm going to sell this as a kit with all this work and I'm going to make a profit at it and feel good about it, I'm going to sell it in the store for 50 bucks. On the bright side, it's extremely easy to use, extremely versatile. The only stove you'll actually need and you will never, ever wear it out. Never. If you buy it, you'll have it for the rest of your life. If you wear it out, you send it back to me, I'll replace it. So it's a lifetime guarantee. You'll never wear it out. Could be your primary cook stove if you're a solo hiker for the rest of your life. 50 bucks. And uh, carry it in cargo pocket, uh, pocket of your cargo pants, uh, in your pack somewhere. You won't find a stove, any more compact than that. And at two ounces, I probably won't find one any lighter. Runs off of readily available alcohol. Always need to bottle the heat. Don't even need to carry a fuel bottle. Just carry the bottle of heat with you. Uh, you could dump the fuel over into other bottles and buy a nipple cap for four and eight ounce bottle if you wanted to. You could do that. There's all kinds of options here. You know, uh, so this is very versatile uh, with the snorkel in it. It's one of a kind. Nobody else is doing this about this. When I send one of these out the door, I don't want to feel like, well, you know, I, I made a little on that. It's okay. No, I, I want to feel like that that was a good quality product. Person's going to have it for the rest of their life. It's a really nice stove, and I made a good profit on it. Yeah, it took me a long time to build it, but I still made a good profit on it, and I feel good about it. And in the bottom line, Mini Bowl Design, there's only two things that really matter. One is that I feel good about it when it goes out the door. I feel, yep, made a good profit on that, good quality item. And two is when you get it, you feel good about it. It's like, wow, that's a nice stove. It works really well. Uh,
customer service is 120%. Lifetime guarantee, if anything on this stove ever breaks, wears out, becomes non-serviceable, send it back to me. Let me look it over, see what I did wrong or whatever. I'll send you a new one. Uh, it was absolutely drop-dead gorgeous yesterday. Uh, Sue and I went for two bike rides and we really had a good time. Uh, out riding a bike, a trike, sorry. I know I'm, somebody's already corrected me. Bikes have two wheels, trikes have three wheels. You ride in a trike, pay attention. I know I built nine of them. I was fairly aware of that. But anyway, thanks for reminding me. Uh, I was out riding my trike. And I, I just wanted to, to express how much of a enjoyment there is in riding along on a trike you built yourself from scratch, from dump parts. Looking over to your right and seeing a beautiful woman riding another trike that you built with your own hands from scratch, from stuff from the dump. Rolling along, wind whistling through your teeth, just sunny day. Beautiful, beautiful. Watching the chain go through the chain line and the tire wheels turn and everything. It's just mind-numbingly fun. Uh, I'm going to go out. It's supposed to be a beautiful day for the next, I don't know, four or five days. So we're going to go out and ride and just enjoy life. I'm Tinny from Mini Bowl Design. Try to have a really great day and try to have some fun today. You deserve it. Bye-bye.